friends, I am making a little video today. I'm cooking, uh, I'll show you here, hold on. Cowboy Cookie Protein Bites, and this is by Sarah Criddle, Mrs. Criddle's Kitchen on um, Pinterest and YouTube and wherever else she is here on my page. Um, I just took this out of my uh, printable Trim Healthy Mama guide, the one that I showed you earlier. So what I have is here in my Mix Master 5000, I've got eggs, butter, some sweetener, um, and other goodies. The whole recipe is here and I will post it. What I'm doing right now is chopping up four and a half ounces of 85% dark chocolate. I happen to like the Moser Roth best and that's the one that you get at Aldi's. And I can't wait because we're getting our Aldi's soon. I think shortly after the first of the year, it's gonna be over at Savannah Quarters um, at the traffic light just past Kroger. And I believe if uh, God is, uh, well, I know God is for us. Don't get me wrong. I'm just saying, if God is for us, then the only thing that could be against us is that what's going across the street would not be the Costco that I heard about. But I heard through the grapevine that Costco is going in right across the street from that Savannah Quarters entrance. And we are going to have a Costco and an Aldi about 30 minutes from my house. I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. New shopping and awesome shopping. If you haven't been to Aldi, Aldi is a discount. You have to bring a quarter and rent your um, shopping cart. When you return it, you get your quarter back. And it you bring your own bags, boxes, whatever, um, just to save some money. They have a skeleton staff there so that they don't have to pay a lot of people to sit around. So um, Aldi's can really save you a lot of money and everything there is, um, sorry, fly away chip. Everything in their store is organic, uh, fresh, inexpensive, um, so THM, keto, and lifestyle friendly. It's just a lifestyle friendly store. So anyway, I am about done chopping my chocolate. And I have, this is an entire bar of, which is five of the little small packages. So this whole thing is four and a half ounces of chocolate that I've chopped into chips to put in my mixer. I'm going to turn my mixer on. I'm sorry for the noise. And I'm going to slowly add um, the flowers. Um, whoops. doing the wrong one. I am. I'll tell you all about it. This is what happens. It's just life. But I'm going to add the flowers, uh, all of my um, really delicious uh, pumpkin pie spices because it's pumpkin pie season, y'all. Um, I have already started my oven on 350. And that is heating up. It's preheating right now. I'm mix oh, you should smell. Oh, I wish this was smell a vision, y'all. This is heavenly. So I've got my flowers in. I'm gonna just give that a little, just gonna give that a little push down on the sides so that yeah, there's a lot of butter still hanging out there. And there ain't nothing wrong with some butter. I just don't want it hanging on the sides of my mix master and not getting into the bar mixture. So now that that is mixed up, I'm going to dump in my chocolate chips. Turn that down a little bit. I'm just going to mix these in gently. And then I'm going to go um, press these into the pan and bake them and I'll be back. All right, I'm about to clean my mess from uh, getting this thing prepared, these bars prepared. 
And I just want to share a little something. This video will be a little longer, and that's okay. Um, my goal as a Trim Healthy Mama coach for this page and just for me as a Trim Healthy Mama um, in the time of life that I'm in is to reach out to other mamas who, um, you know, are just looking to make some changes, who are looking to um, become healthy, to learn new habits for eating, to realize that they've got the strength that they need through Christ to do this, to live this lifestyle, to maintain their health and their family's health this way. So that is my idea for this page. And my focus is loosely, but hopefully, um, no, I, I don't want to say primarily, but my, my focus really is on women who are in the time of their life where their bodies are changing. Um, some of you are young mamas and you are good personal friends of mine and I am so blessed uh, to be part of your life and you being part of my life is um, just an amazing joy and seeing your kiddos and hearing stories and just sharing with you is just incredible. Um, and I have to say, because I was a young mom, well, I was never a young mom. I adopted at 38 and then gave birth at 39 um, to the only children I, that I have. Um, but as a mom, uh, your brain tends to function very similar to my 52-year-old uh, uh, falling hormonal brain. Um, and so that's kind of why I wanted to focus on women in this phase of life is that we can laugh together, we can share joy together, uh, we can tell grandkids stories or teenage stories or baby stories and everybody will understand it. Anybody on this page is going to just giggle with you and say, girl, I gotcha. I know just what you're going through. So that being said, this is full disclosure here, y'all. I, um, I showed you a recipe for Mrs. Criddle's um, protein bites that I was making today. And uh, I will post that, um, and I will make that recipe. But <laughs> the recipe that I actually already had measured... I was chopping my um, chips to put in to show you. I was dumping in my flowers, <clears throat> all those goodies. That recipe was the next one in my book. I had taken um, pumpkin chocolate chip gluten-free bars, which is by Lisa at Low Carb Yum. That's what I'm making. I had taken that out. See, here's my handy dandy little book. I had taken that out and that was sitting over here next to my mix master. The next thing up that I turned my head and looked at was the cowboy, cowboy cookie protein bites by Mrs. Criddle's Kitchen. <sighs> so, Brain fart aside, this is my page, and this is my life, and this is this happens every day. So I'm just going to laugh and go with it. And so when I show you, these will not be cookies. They will be bars. In case I mess it up again, they are pumpkin chocolate chip gluten-free bars by Lisa at Low Carb Yum. I'm going to try to post that recipe, and I'll go ahead and I'll post Mrs. Criddle's, Sarah Criddle's uh, Cowboy Cookie Protein Bites onto the page as well. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, so I finished doing my dishes and I actually made the Mrs. Criddle's um, Cowboy Protein Bites. Super, super simple, y'all. The actual ingredients for this one are a uh, half a cup of butter, some sweetener, Almond flour. I used the uh, Trim Healthy Mama just because I don't have almond flour. Uh, some protein, plain protein powder. And it says you can use uh, some old-fashioned oats 
or more almond flour or oat fiber or peanut flour. I love peanut anything, peanut butter, so I like the peanut butter chocolate kind of mix thing. So I used uh, the peanut flour, some vanilla black strap, strap molasses, uh, mineral salt, pecans, coconut, and chocolate chips. So I just chopped up a couple more bars. So I'm going to turn this off now and start uploading it. And when everything comes out of the oven and the freezer, because the Mrs. Criddles bars, uh, the protein bites, you just form and put them in the freezer. Let them get cold and you can store them in the fridge or the freezer. We'll keep them in the freezer because um, I'm really kind of making these to get ready for my surgery. It's a week from tomorrow. So um, anyway, blessings, y'all. Thank you so much. I am just beyond grateful to have each one of you with me and just following my health journey joining me and sharing your health journey i love when you ask me questions i love when you engage on my page or privately um, and just never ever forget that the foods that i make that i show you that i take pictures of the foods that i um post on my site through blogs all of that is a gift from god it is the food that we need to live to thrive and to be healthy but jesus is what we need for life